or bringing me into your game. For it was. Waiting for host to accept your request to join. Oh. Okay. I, I thought I had to send the as I said, wait for the invite, but I guess you don't need to Well wait, see when I, I accepted your party it says you can join uh it said it could join your game, so Huh. I did not know that was a thing. Me neither. There you go. That's handy. Um Don't forget to uh there you go, well done. Um I forgot what we were planning to do next. Um, well, we are going to the Arcane Tower, weren't we? Were we? I think so, that's... As far as I'm aware, we took out the... Okay, so we, um... We did all the stuff with the mushrooms. Mushroom stuff's all done. That, that sounds we, that sounds so weird. <laughs> we took out the Zentarum that are down at the, uh, the beach. Do the, I, uh, you mean... There's still, like, the mini bar holder to fight. Still, um, it's like a beholder, but it's smaller. I can't. I keep forgetting about that. I can't even remember what that's what that's associated uh, with. We, we all we, what we do is we'll go back to the Silmite outpost and we'll go out the window instead of out the gate, and it'll be right down there. And there's a quest associated with that. No, but there's a one of the bodies there has an item that we need to pick up. Okay. Well, then, uh, should we do that first? Sure. All right. Um, could you move from the waypoint a little bit? Because you're, I, I think, Will's. There we are. Thank you. Because uh, your icons were covering the waypoint marker I couldn't select it. I mean, I suppose I could have done it the official way. So you said there was a window? Yep, right over here. Oh, I never even noticed that. Yep. Yeah, you see the, um, you see the, like, crystals over here? And, like, there's the bodies? You say over here, remember, we're not using the same camera. Okay, um, uh, well, look where I'm, stand where I'm standing and look in the direction I'm standing. Okay. You see the bodies uh, over there. Like the uh, statues. Oh, the statues. Okay. Yep. I've got those to say, are petrified, what bodies? Yeah, those are petrified Petrified drow. Yep. Oh. And he will revive them during the fight, and they will fight on his side. That sounds... Uh, okay. You know what? Sure. I'll, uh... Unfortunately, I don't think we can ambush him. Oh, surprised. Of course we are. Yep. I am really glad how my character turned out. How tough can it be? It's not like we it didn't auto say it's not like it auto it didn't auto save beforehand. It can't be that tough. Uh, it was pretty tough. <laughs> oh, I'm just beating her. Bringing Will into the fight, sorry. Okay, I feel like we should take him out first. Yeah, no, that's definitely a good idea. If we can. Well, he's not going to be directly in our way, so... Yeah, you know, maybe. of all things that could have been, that probably isn't so bad. Yeah. Alright, so let's plan first, so before we do anything. I, I said... I know, but I'm moving closer at least, so... Like, I, I'm no see. use if I don't get into melee. 82 HP. Thing is, could we... I know I said 
we should turn them out first, but at the same time, the less turns the enemy side has, the better. So mm. we... So well, also, if we kill him would... fast enough, he can't revive anyone else. Yeah, you know, that is a very valid point. I just... Okay, well, um... Okay, I don't have any body inspiration, so my best bet is probably... Actually, you know what? First things first, let's investigate the guy. Uh, no resistances or whatever. Um, and no actual traits either. Nothing of import. You know what really annoys me is that the movement speed says zero feet. Um, He's at a fly speed, yeah. No, 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 no. No matter what creature you scan, it's always zero feet movement speed, so you can't gauge how far they can move. That sucks. It's really weird. Um... I'm kind of tempted by magic missile, to be honest. Let me see if I can get uh, into melee with it. Because I don't know if I can. Is that okay? Uh, sorry, what were you asking? I'm asking if I can get into melee, try to get into melee with it. Uh, well, instead of trying, see if just when you go to select, see if it let, see if it tells you too much movement speed or not. It says not enough movement speed, but I can yeah, fix so, that. So the oh, you mean step of the wind? Yeah. Oh wait, hold on a second. When am I ever going to use this? Um. I'm gonna do sunbeam on him. Why not? Yeah, okay, go for it. Ah, oh, that was a very low roll. I mean, it's not bad. Got quite a chunk off. I'm just trying to decide what spells I can. I should use. If I cost that third level, <coughs> how much would that be? 17 average and if I cast magic missile which I have an extra dart for at oh wait no that's not magic missile that's uh that's my once a day magic missile yeah <laughs> where's my actual magic missile I do have that right Oh, do you know you don't have that until you can plunder it with magic secrets? You've only got magic missile as the uh, from the item that gets it to you. You're a bard. Or Damn! Or I, I forgot the boss didn't get it by default. Yep, you gotta plunder it. Well, that sucks. Um, well, that's 8 to 20, so that's 14 average. But it's a guarantee. Hmm. I think I'll go for the magic missile because it's a guarantee. Okay. Not bad. Yeah, I'd say so. And? And I can have Will shoot both uh, the Drow and the uh, Beholder guy. Well, hmm, yeah. Uh, I mean, tell you what, I'll see how far... Um, Let's see how far uh, Shadowheart can move, and she might be able to take him down by himself, and then he can, and Will can focus on the Beholder. Okay. Because she doesn't really have. Yeah, I think that's everything I can do. Uh, uh, okay. Why didn't I get a reaction attack? I was like right up against. Do you have it. it no, you weren't. I, I was. You weren't quite aware you would have been able to melee attack with your oh, bonus action, right. remember? Alright, so let's see how if I can reach... Oh, I can reach the guy, but I'm pretty sure... Can she reach the... Yeah, she even with a jump, she can't reach the boulder. So let, let, um, let's um let see if Shadowheart can uh, take Doran up first before we decide what to do with Will. Hold on. Yeah. No, the spectator's too far away for a blast anyways. Uh, even if you move? Oh, wait, wait, uh, before moved, we decide yeah. that. Oh, you have? Blimey hell. Yep. Alright, um... 
I've got no spell slots to Misty Step either. Well, he's dead, so... I guess that's... Will's not going to do anything this way. Hold on, there's another enemy that will target. He's not dead, is he? Nope. He's got like one hit point left. <laughs> well, I do have... Javelins. 70% uh, chance... 80 percent chance, but I definitely won't kill the Beholder. Yeah, this I think turn. my character can get in there and finish it, so... Yeah, probably. Alright, um... Yeah, see if you can do it first, but don't waste anything. Don't use any resources. There we go. Sinchute's magic item that was on its body. Uh, okay, what? what the hell? Uh, the exploded mushroom. Hang on, hang on, before you do anything else. That's what hit you. Okay. Go ahead. I was coming over here to check the uh, body. Yeah, I'll check this one. Uh,. I would. Oh, there it is. Memory shard, uh, potion of healing. Send that to you. Yeah, the gold. Uh, Silver necklace. I see pick that up. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's a special item. Yeah, I forgot yep. about that. Send a supply camp to camp. The blast pendant, lightning blast. I think it might be. Uh, I think it might be just like let me use something, use a lightning magic of some kind. And since I have used my magic missile for the day, mind if I put it on? Sure, go ahead. All right. Uh, oh. Um. Actually, while I'm while I think about it. I was uh, feeling a bit peaky there. Well, yeah, I did a lot of damage. Yeah, I didn't even notice until the fight was yeah. over. <laughs> now the uh, uh, the other thing that's down here, the the bull leg or whatever it is, attacked me all on my way down from this area. So we might get hit by it. I mean, I fought the bullet. I can't remember where it was, but I. Uh... See where it, was. it was like right over. You can't see where I'm looking, but it was like right down at the bottom of this like staircase area over here. Where it ambushed me. And there's Ooh. a little drow camp down there too with loot. Wounding Ray. Huh. Well, let's see what the Blast Pendant actually does before I... Oh. Need lightning charges? Well, that sucks. Um, honestly, okay, okay. Mm, it, it works better it. if you have an item that uses lightning, that makes lightning charges, like the bow or the spear or the trident. Yeah, I guess. I suppose we should just add it to wearers, huh? Probably. And uh, I guess I'll wear the pendant because it's. Well, I'm a magic user, I guess. Now, let's see what this gives me. Wounding Ray. Oh. That's it? 2 to 16 damage? The hell? Uh, I guess it's That's like a, a third. It's supposed to be a third level spell, isn't it? I don't know about wounding ray. Once a day, two sixteen. 
No, no, hold on. Let me look that up. Let me look at the spell again, right? That's pretty shy. I mean, okay, I guess the fear effect could be handy as if you're lucky, but. That seems really weak for a third level spell. Yeah, a lot of people have pointed that out as well, how weak it is. Oh, good, it's not just me. Um, I might as well have the magic missile on back on for when I, before I forget to put it on later. So say, don't forget, you can have uh, two rings on. Yeah, I just realized that. I'm. I'm only wearing one ring for myself. Um, would you like a ring that gives plus one to nature and survival? Don't know as much Not use, but. Nature, yeah. No, I'll just add it to wear because I don't see it being particularly useful. Like, even on my ranger character, I don't need those because I've got a good enough nature and survival anyway, so that I'm passing those checks without a plus one bonus. Right, uh, so where was it you were pointing out? Uh, down over here. We have to go through the little poison cloud, though, so be aware of that going forward. Ah, oh, God. Uh, that oh, sucks. Oh, we have to go down. Uh, ah. I'm not playing Avengers. Stop pressing the L3 button hoping to dash. There's some gold and some magic arrows. Ah, oh, that's fine, they're nothing. Oh, that's, yeah, they're always good. The hell? I didn't even see that. Alright, well, all right, uh, okay, we should be able to, if we jump. do it step by step and just sort of jump around. Oh, I, I saw it. I see him now. Okay, stay behind me. These have a DC of 30 to disarm? What the fuck? <laughs> Good gracious. I mean, they are drow traps, and drow are pretty good at setting traps. I mean, sure, but... Alright, where do we go from here? Like, um... Is there a way down from climbing that or there's there's that staircase that's right inside the poison so we have to go through the poison to get to the staircase or we can feather fall our way down there that oh i forgot about that all right you ready uh hold on yeah i i hope you make sure the others are all in range too oh easily and oh okay i love that little animation there we're good oh no they're bringing themselves down okay all right all right let me take the lead just in case yep here he comes He's not actually out of the ground yet. Did it put? Did you put us into um, turn-based mode? Nope. Defender of the people. Ah, damn. I was really hoping that wouldn't happen. There we go. That was odd. One day, I'll catch a break. Can I get to him in melee? I all right, let's see if we can't do a bit of range damage. Um, oh, I have to... 
Okay, uh... uh let's see... So that's about an average of 20 damage. This is my time. Okay, and then Elvish Blast from Will. Ah, hell, he can't... Can't get a shot. No, there we go, maybe now I can get a shot. Nope, path is interrupted. I'm All right, let, let, oh. Hold on, I can fix that. Well, so much for peace. There we go. Well, there never mind. <laughs> He did not go down that easily when I fought him, but then he had to have a paladin in the group either. Yeah. Also, what difficulty were you playing on? Um, the medium one. Yeah, I sent exactly. I magic item that he had on him. I just went to pick it up as well. Uh, hold on. Don't run off. Just standing in the camp. I'm trying to remember what's over here. Last thing we need, last thing we need is for you to walk and um, start a conversation when you're not the charisma of the party. <laughs> Uh, I'll send that to Carlax if she wants it. Sounds like something she'd want. Okay. Uh, there's a chest Even... over here for you to pick, too. Ah, perfect. Okay, let's quick save because we've done a little bit. Okay. 35. You think you've got enough bonuses? Empty boxes and spider webs. Guess Lolf's cultists haven't been back here in a while. Uh, let's see, Chris Page. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, antidote could come in handy. Yep. Gold. And Drow Studded Leather mm -hmm. Armor. Stealth plus. So basically, uh, Studded Leather Armor with plus one stealth. Uh, I suppose Astarian would like that. Okay. Um, that's a dead end. God, this, I didn't realize there were so many different challenge modes of Final Fantasy VII. Oh god! All right, hold on. Limits only, oh. items only, girls only, cloud only. I don't know how you do the girl only one. I guess you knock cloud unconscious and just have the girls do all the fighting. you can shoot that far. Oh, you have a long bow, I have a short bow. Also, I'm rolling with disadvantage, except you're not rolling, because they're 100% they're, they're guaranteed. Uh, 100, that's, that, that was an oxymoron. Uh, okay. Oh, hello, I on. Ah, I thought those were one of those that did that. Something's burrowed in there. Something big. I think we already killed that thing, didn't we? Yeah, I think you weren't really supposed to use the window. Unless you're in something else. Scorched ground. This is how I Oh, 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 this is the... Where we're at the tower. Yep, yep. Well, now that I have bludgeon uh, damage, I should be able to get in there and destroy them without too much difficulty as a as a. That's monk. true. Um, oh, I almost dropped my controller. Um, I actually sent a steering in here by himself and snuck him through the entire place, pretty much. I mean, that that's an alternative. But, okay, so I think first things first, let's lean up close to the wall. Yep. And now we're going to the turn based mode. Alright. Good luck. No problem. 
What I'm going to do this round is I'm going to dash to get out of sight, and then I'm going to move in to destroy it on the next turn. Sure. You can hit me through the rock, so. Sharp as ever. Okay. Um. So might be a bit too in sight, so let's move you over there. I've got a lot right. right ahead. I still don't have enough movement to reach it, so we're gonna have to use a key. Ah, uh, hold on, there's another hiding spot, I think. Oh, over here, on the other side? Well, um trying to figure it out hang on i remember i there was another place i hid behind can you no no reaching the turret would be closer um hmm if i dash and hit it i can then move back over here where the other one can't hit me and i can start working my way up towards it next turn maybe and I've got a, I got wholeness of body, so I can get all my key back now once a day. So. Oh, cool. So I'm gonna do it. Good luck. Wait, why is it not letting me attack? I. Maybe it's the rear you've got to reach because I know I've done it. Oh, okay. So I realized the issue with um. This turn is disabled, right? It's not. Living. No, it's not that. No, no, it's not that. That's what I meant. Um, so just to clarify, it is neutral to uh, bludgeoning damage. It's weak to lightning. Oh, okay. Um, but. I don't know if we've got anyone who... That's okay, I, I, can give... take care of them. I took care of one of them. That that one's not active anymore. Okay. This I'm pretty sure it's not. It's not lit up anymore. That's good. Uh... Yeah, see, it's not turning to target Shadowheart. Oh, I didn't realize yeah, I was I... in line of sight. Sorry about that. I don't worry, I didn't attack, so we're fine. It's okay, I got it. Me. And I'm clear, anyway, so... Okay, so it disables it, but then it heals itself automatically. Okay, this turns down. Where's the next turn? It's inside, I guess. No, there's. I thought there was a third on not outside. That I'm seeing. Uh, oh, maybe not. No, I don't see. It. I thought it was okay. Maybe it was just the two. Yeah, we could. Oh, the door's locked. You'll have to get up here and unlock it. Uh, <laughs> temporarily leave. Um... Yeah. Oh, I could go through this window actually. I mean, you could, or we could just use the door. Alright, once I've picked the lock, um, get let's ready. Be, get ready, yeah. I'm going to go turn base mode back on to uh, before we actually go through the door. 
Okay. Right, you'll open the door with your action. Uh, might as well. All right, now if we reach, if we go, sorry. Before we do anything else, let's go through the um. Let's go up to where we've got cover, regardless of where we are. So the pillars and the. You know, just just so that we're safe. Kind of hard to go through the doors. Apparently, Will was not as safe as I thought he was. Then again, the damage is so negligible. I could just heal you guys up every time one of us gets low, and we'd have just. I mean, that's walked true, but this is kind of cool, though, you gotta admit. Oh, absolutely. I'm just saying. Like, like for just seeing it as it is, I'm like, we could have just. Okay, sure. Can Shadowheart reach that other one? Um, even if she could, I think she'd have to dash to do it. And even That's if she fine. could, I'll get to it next turn. She's only got slashing weapons and and the like. That's okay. I'll get to it next turn. Unless actually, maybe she could. What's its relationship with radiance? Neutral to radiance. But, do we... Mm. Don't waste a smell slot on it. I was thinking that, yeah. I mean, yeah, just let I'm me handle doing it. That. Yeah, alright. Also, there's a traveler. Oh, you know, you could have just tanked the hit and I'd have healed you up after. Well, that's fair. But, no Done. more shooting. Yep, that's it. I think that was the last turn. Maybe there's some on the higher floors. But... I'm not so sure. Uh, okay, now there's a guide here for this tower. Um, that I'm just going to use. If I could just find it, it would be nice. Yeah, I have so, done so this before, not... so... I know, but like there are some specifics. Did you know about the chest? Yes. The one that... Yes, the chest okay. is magically disguised. It's, it looks like it has yeah. just mundane loot in it, but it doesn't. Okay, you do know that one. Cool. Yeah. Because uh, I, I didn't know if you would. Um, okay, this is starting to... Alright, um, I've got the feeling I need to go to the bathroom, so I'll be back in a minute, alright? Okay. Pick up seventy five, six needs.
past. Mm -hmm. Welcome back. Uh, I'm back. Yeah. All right. So let's have a look what we're doing. So uh, while you were away, I was uh, checking out this uh, trailer for this movie called Annabelle or Abigail. It's about a uh, bunch of people that are being hunted by a child vampire. Oh uh, yeah, I've I've heard I've heard of that. We've, we've got. It set it, up for it. It, it set it up to make you feel um, bad for the people at first, but then I read the like the uh, synopsis of it on the wik on Wikipedia, and they kidnapped the girl to try to force somebody to pay them like a half a million dollars. So I no longer feel bad for the people who are being eaten by said child vampire. I know, but the thing is, who else is she killing the process besides them? That so is it's not going to be just them. That is a fair statement, but. At the same time, I kind of don't want them to win because they don't deserve to win. <laughs> it, does that make sense? Well, they say children will be such monsters. Uh, it's meant to be a horror film, so I'm not going to... Well, just imagine like being an adolescent not being in full control of your mind and also being you know, a bloodthirsty vampire that craves human flesh. Like, that, was, that sounds like a very bad combination. Thought I would light up the place a little bit. You know, close the door so nothing comes in on us. So oh, like, like they would. One of the windows is open, so I mean, you could just come right through if they wanted, but you know. I know, but they're not going to. Like, come I on, know. there's... there's... Oh hey, I didn't get this this morning. Yeah, it's 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 really it was really close, which is funny. The mundane chest. Yep. No, you gotta go through a Pacific. Did that just transform? 
I know we don't need all the stuff I just grabbed, but... You just want to look and see what's in there? I, I couldn't tell which was which at the yeah. time, so... You can't, so that's uh, the whole point of the chest. <laughs> We do not need a scroll of mage armor because no one's actually going to use that. Uh... I mean, technically you could use it on Gale and you wouldn't have to use a spell slot one day, but... I mean, I guess, but at the same time, just... Mm. When else is he going to use one of his four, first four one-level spell slots on? Your first level spell slot? <laughs> yeah, it's, that's it. It's, you might as well just get the money for it. I just that was something else. Uh, ah, here we are. Featherfall, uh, Featherfall boots. Oh, that's actually pretty useful. Oh, I mm. used those on, uh, I used those on Asterion when I was, uh, in, uh, in, uh, raiding this tower. I was like, oh, those are cool, and I used them on him to get him into one specific part of the because you have to drop down at one point, and the only way to do it safely was with the uh, feather pole. I mean, it's not like we're that bothered by it, are we? No, not particularly. Um, no. um, do we need those, or could we just put them on for sale? Because I can just cast feather pole if we need it. I mean, I don't have any magic boots on, so I mean, I guess it wouldn't hurt for me to have them. Oh, I thought you had some. Okay. Nope, I just have nice. regular leather boots. There you go then. Thank you. Let's see what they look like. Uh, I'm gonna change my. Uh... Not bad. Still not the biggest fan of this armor. I just don't like how it looks all bony and skeleton. Skeleton. It'd be helpful because unfortunately, um, slow fall doesn't work the way it's supposed to. <laughs> no, I know, right? That's yeah. kind of sad, especially since slow fall was so good in D and D. Oh, uh, how are you like in Shivering Isles and uh, in Oblivion, Joe? Mm. That's all right. Quite uh. Well, You're it's like... nutty as 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 I mean, one word. It's supposed word. to be. It's Shiagora. <laughs> Exactly. So, so it's living up to that, if nothing else. Right, we've got some things we need to grab here. Uh... We need a sucker blossom too, don't we? Mm, that was that the other item we needed. I don't know. Just I thought confirm. it was. A, no, no. I thought it was another um, madness named item. Oh, it was like a mushroom. Okay, check the journal and tell you. Yeah. Ten mask spores. Ten mask spores. Well, there's a sprouting ten mask over here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, okay. Um, oh no, here's some spores just over here. Alright, got them. Okay. Alright, so that's done. Now let's just fall the rest of this tower. Um, Alright, let's... Western, western corner, there should be a book I need to read. 
think it's upstairs, isn't it? It's on the I top. Send the... No, I'm pretty sure it's this floor. I mean, it's sand. It's this floor. Okay, why would you put a candle up that high where we can't turn it on? Ah, uh, here we go. Okay. Oof. What's wrong? No, I just seen the damage. I mean, it's not a big deal oh, you for us. Okay. And they just take, like, nothing. Alright, asshole. That's because I cast Featherfall on everybody. <laughs> well, why did you bother? Because I had a free use of it. When else were we going to use it today? Oh, well, I guess. Alright, now let's see. These flowers. What is this feeling? Something over there. Okay, now we need the sister blossoms. Also, why are you running ahead? I was looking for something in particular, sorry. Eesh. One of these days, actually no, we've had it before, you're going to walk into a conversation you are not ready for. Yeah, in this place, I know where the only conversation is, we're nowhere near it. <laughs> Alright. So um, I'm awesome. going to hold on to the Sucker Blossoms because the anti-magic field will prevent you from using magic. And I'm pretty sure you'll want to use your magic. Anyway, let's open the door. <laughs> Alright, we're in. Um... Now we need to fix the elevator. Yeah. Is that what the sucker blossoms were? I don't remember. Yes, it is. Um... I think there's a bowl or something to put them in. Yeah, no, you've, yeah, you've got to go to the generator and use the sucker blossom, sucker blossom to restore power. Oh, so wait a minute. Where... Uh... Oh. Hold on. I'm gonna send the other sister blossom back to camp so we can stop messing with our magic, so And the elevator's working and the arcane turrets are 
power down, even though we had already defeated them. And the arcane braziers are lit. That that be a light. Oh, that should be the title of this episode. Let there be light. What do you think? Yeah, sure. All right. Actually, I've got another one. Oh. What one eye too many? Oh. <laughs> Oh, the beholder's way too many turns. That's true. Uh, make sure there isn't anything we need to pick up over here. No. The Underdark Where's Adventures the... continue for the Pyro Sea Buddies. I'm just trying to find the where the chest is. It might be up the stairs. It said it was opposite the generator. Hmm, interesting. I'm not having any luck finding it. Um, wait, oh maybe... My. Okay. No, I don't see any chest down here, sorry. Like, there might be one up the stairs, but it's not down here. Maybe. Then why would they say opposite the generator? I don't understand that. Let's have a look around here. See There's a chest right here, which is technically opposite the generator. Sent you the item that was inside. It was a necklace. Undiscovered oh, that, mysteries. Oh, yeah, that's what they were talking about. Yep, so Why they should they have said up the, the stairs. Up the stairs and opposite the elevator, shouldn't yeah? That's what it should have said. Oh. <laughs> That is what it said. Well, I didn't mention up the stairs, but it did mention opposite the elevator, not the generator. That okay. was me. Well done. Everybody in? Uh, just a second. Sorry, I was checking out that item. It's uh, I gave you detect. It's a necklace that has detect thoughts. Yeah. So what what floor are we going up to? Uh, well. Oh, there we are. There you are. <laughs> We need to keep going up, I believe. Or down. Uh, I can't remember which. So, are we... This is the... This is not the... Well, so This is the ground floor we came in at. Oh, oh, I see. It's which switch, so we go up and down, up and down, so... Correct, yes. And this is the entrance floor, I think. We were is already it? on the entrance floor. No, 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 this is no. the entrance floor, you're right, you're right. That's what I meant. I shut the door, yeah. This takes us up to the top. Yeah, well, this is the next one up, so this is the one we want. Is that the floor above the entrance? And then on the south side, there should be a book that we need to read. There's also a thing if you find, uh, there's a collar. I believe this is the book you're probably talking about, right over here on the desk, Roads to Darkness. That's it. Making myself useful and lighting up the place. Which is funny, I have dark vision. You think I wouldn't need to do this? Right. Oh, I bet, um, I bet Will might like that. I can't remember what it does.
More like what? The mage's friend. Oh, it's just a uh, plus one to Arcana religion, I believe. Oh, never mind then. Not that great then. <laughs> I thought it was yeah, like... I just put it. I just put it into wares. Plenty left to see. And it's key, I keep forgetting I've got scrolls. I really need to remember that I have them so I have an excuse to use them. Uh, Ascending. I believe it. Uh, let me just check. There is technically a basement too, but I think we have to go to the top floor before we can go to the basement. Oh my goodness, it's a big puppy dog. So we've got options here. We can use what we know to just end, not fight. Or we could fight him to try and get the Light of Creation Glaive, which is a plus one, with an extra d6 damage and a chance to stun... Oh, oh. Chance to stun the wielder. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Um, I believe that I ended up having to fight him anyways, after all was said and done. Don't see why. I can't remember precisely, but I'm just, I remember I ended up in a fight with him anyhow. While you're doing that, I'm just going to put myself in position. Am I needed? I go to town on one of his allies. Just in case. Ah, uh, yes. This is what one of the ones we'll need for later. Nice. I don't think there's anything else up here, so down we go, I guess. Okay, you sure you don't want to fight? I mean, do you? I mean, they seem to be made of experience points. <laughs> How mercenary. Uh... I mean, I don't mind if you don't, but I thought we were playing good guys. Well, we are playing good guys, but they're just like... Alright, fine, we can leave them, but they might attack the next group of people that come through here. Oh. Well, really, they're supposed to stop people from breaking in anyway. That's true. Anyways, that is, like, I'm surprised like they playing... actually ended up attacking me the last time I came here. Like, I did this thing correctly, and they still ended up attacking me. can't see how they would, because this, this is both times for me it's been like this. So. Well, I don't know. I talked to them again afterwards, and there was a dialogue option when I picked it. They attacked us, so... 
Ah, uh, maybe that was why. Maybe. But down to the basement? Right, now let's actually I need to know where we need to go first. Oh, I see. Yeah, we just keep descending to get to the basement. No, we don't. Hmm? That's how I got there last time, I thought. You need to have one of the... You need to have the ring equipped. Oh, okay. And then you have to activate it to get in, yeah. Yeah. That's right. I think we need to be at the top first. My ring lit up. Must have been linked to that button. Basement, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't yeah, go yeah, down there. Shoot. Go. Oh, well. I mean, you could send me the ring and I could equip it and come down. I mean, there's not all my aura. It was faster just to grab the stuff that's here and then just leave. I mean, it's true, but I'm the one whose stream is going to be saved, so... <laughs> Ah, uh, it's not much important. The, the trick, the whole point is getting the trick to do it, and then they can see if they do it for themselves when they play. There's, it's like there's no story here or anything. We just need. Uh... Uh... I'm gonna go down uh... to the uh, the ground floor to wait for you. There's a way on foot to get in here. Is it? Yeah, there's a door leading out, which means that you can use it to get in. I don't know where it's at. Um, I'll uh, t I'll uh, I'll leave that way and uh, see if I can't. You're you're only using one ring, right? Yes. Here's a ring for resistance to lightning damage, better than nothing. Ooh. Spark blocker. Can't be electrocuted. And... Actually, that's really useful. Electrocution's a really annoying ability. Or a status condition. I don't remember where the the collar is because there's a collar that you can get and there's a thing you can do here with the uh, the collar. I can't uh, yeah. away from me remember where it is. I think it was out. In, I think it was out in the garden. I'm looking through the garden now. So, oh, you know what? No, I think I remember. It was not anywhere near the tower. It was they buried the dog near the big sucker tree. Like, this is a small one. Remember the big one that's over where the... Oh, uh... Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's where its grave is. Do we want to go get that and have to deal with the Edder Cat, sir? Mm, nah. I mean, the guide here even said, like, we won't spoil what happens, but you're not missing much. So... It's funny, though. What kind of staff do you have again? Uh, uh, what does it give you? My oh, no, it's not a staff. It's your, it's the Lathander. Portal Lathander, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah, no. You don't want this, so I'll send it to Will. Oh, uh, Gail. Sorry. Yeah, I'm walking people with the staff, of, or with the Blood of Lathander. By Lathander's light, be saved! Oh, hell. You underestimate the, the glory of Lathander. Lathander sees you in your sleep. <laughs> Uh, 
Um, right, let me just grab the rest of the loot and then I will be... You know, I'm kind of sad they're not doing any more doing DLC, especially with the what they set up with Arabelle. If you remember what they set up with Arabelle. Yeah, but like, all, all that does is give you an extra companion in the final fight. Yeah, but you know, she could come back later on and have her own adventures, is what I mean. Oh, I see. You can only access it from this side. Yeah. Um, and uh, then you just leave it to open it, so now you can come in without it. But okay. Uh, it's in the room with the generator. Yep, I see it now. Cool. I um, since we're done with the tower, should we just walk back to um? The colony and speak to O'Malum? Yep, that's probably a good idea. Oh man, everyone's uh, going somewhere. I didn't realize it was rush hour. I'm trying to remember what it is you get for doing this. I have no idea. Unfortunately, I didn't even know this was a thing. I didn't even see the mind player when I was here. I talked to the bugbear, but I must have completely overlooked the mind player. Um. Maybe I have a look. Everything okay? Yeah, I'm just reading up on...
Okay, doing this gets to, I'm um, assuming, 1 XP into the Ring of Mind Shielding, which I think is going to be kind of handy somehow. Yeah, probably. Just a hunch, maybe. You know, all things considered. Ah, here they are. I greet you, child of the sun. How has your search for the mushrooms fared? I was born with a propensity for arcane magic my people despise. It gave me the strength to resist the elder brain. Every waking hour I pushed back against its dire hold. My wizardry empowered me. The moment its control shattered, I fled. Before the colony discovered, I had defected. Yeah, a lot of people don't realize that mind players are not completely responsible for their own actions. In the beginning, I had an arrangement with a lich. Excellent company, despite what one would expect. I required brains, he required souls, a perfect symbiosis. But our ambitions eventually splintered. I wished to better the world, and he preferred its rot. So I left his company, and thus I now feed from those who act against the society's goals. Perhaps the peoples of the Underdark will be less inclined to violence if they comprehend the cost, yes? These are fine specimens. It will only take me a moment to brew them to proper potency. Omelium turns away to prepare the potion, lost in its own musings. You must drink the entire draught. I can make no promises as to its taste. The potion is disgusting beyond description. The only mercy is that it goes down quickly. Not a drop left. Very good. As the potion influences your mind, you may find yourself acting irrationally. Try and stay focused. The world loses its edges, its finer boundaries. You are fluid, but trapped like a creature suspended in amber. All right, now let's see. Uh... Ooh, this might be better. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a few sparks and colors dance around Omelion, but you stay steady and staring ahead. The tackle spasms, seizes. It's fighting the potion even harder than you are. Fear pierces your mind like knives of ice. The parasite digs deeper, as if it means to hollow out your skull. Oh, you're gonna be really? Oh, really? So... Like, you have to literally. <laughs> yeah. The cold blades lose their edge. You are stalwart, turning that tide of fear against itself. The parasite swells with power. 
more power than you have ever felt before. It surges and twists, lashing out against that which would dare to intrude. The parasite in your mind quiets, pleased with itself. Oh, man. Damn, parasite. Are you well? That lava is like nothing I have ever observed before. Its power is unsettling. Such an outcome was not in my calculations. There is more to this being than mere stasis. Indeed, although I may have another solution, albeit a temporary one, I possess a ring of mind shielding. It prevents elder brains from noticing my presence. It will not remove the lava, but it will limit its influence, both positive and negative. I would offer it as a gift, but in truth, the ring is priceless. Is there anything you could offer me in turn? What does the oh, guide say you should offer? Uh, I mean, the guide recommends just telling him about your adventures. Um, every last detail. But uh, I'm a bard. There's a bard option. Oh, I don't even see the so, bard option. Oh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I gotta do this. You gotta do the mind up. Yeah. Yeah. Once upon a time, before the time watches your performance, something stirs in his mind, unusual for an illithid. Joy. Here, it is yours. I wonder what he would think of the emperor. May it serve you as well as it has served me. That thing better work. If it doesn't, I doubt you'll be in any position to complain. Of course, the lava remains. Be ever vigilant of its growth. How is your mind, mind over mushrooms? <laughs> research progressing. Uh, what was your question, sir? I said, I wonder what he would think of the Emperor. Uh. Right, I don't think I've got the space for... Oh, oh ring of mind shielding, but what about you? What's it do specifically? Uh, if I could find it, that would be being, an excellent question. Being push charmed. To well, I already have advantage on saving throws against being charmed because I'm half elf. And so do you. Yeah. Will could use it though, he's only got one ring. Oh, okay. Then I'll, uh, I'll send it to him. Just once I yeah. figure out and Shadowheart has advantage as well because she's also an elf. <laughs> or half elf. Three half elves and a horn dude. <laughs> Have you spoken with Scris lately? Looks like I'm surrounded by three half elves. Yes. She is cataloging Koto and Fatima. Like not to mention all that half elf horn elf out that's fine. <laughs> oh god, that research here, I'll join her. That was a on the spot decision. I was like, what is the most cringe thing that could be in the crates? Half elf horn. Ah, okay. Uh, sending that to Will. The hero at heart. I like to imagine as the ship was going down, the captain was sitting in their bed, uh, going through their magazine. Captain, the ship is going down. The captain's just like Scruffy's going to die doing what Scruffy loved. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, you evil bastard! <laughs> it was like my very first D&D &D session, I was um, like, what's your goal for this campaign? Well, it's Curse of Strahd. Like, the, the person who's driving else's cart's gonna be sitting there 
going through his dirty magazines while you're all fighting. And when Strahd comes for him, he's going to be like, Scruffy's going to die doing what Scruffy loved. <laughs> you said the same joke twice. What the hell? I, know. <laughs> I made that, I made that reference a lot. <laughs> it's because it's hilarious. Oh, uh, I also got um, inspiration for turning on the elevator. Oh, nice. So being... Phil Darson's got some weird stuff. Rescue Oscar, restore um... power to the elevator, and gather ingredients for a melon's potion. Not much, but more than what we had before, so, you know. Yeah. But, but yeah, that's that. So, um, okay. Okay, we are at, so we got 39 minutes left, so yeah, questions so we more. get into. Uh, I guess we could go to the, uh, we could take the boat. Yeah, I think, that's it. I, think that's it. I think that's the only thing that's left, actually. Yeah, I can't think of anything else down here. Find the missing boots. Did we do that already? No. No, we did not. At least I don't think so. We didn't even talk to them about the boots. We just flat up killed them. Oh, we need to find someone to start the quest. Okay. Uh... Oh, her! Have you spoken with Scris lately? Yes, she is cataloging Koto and Fatal. Oh, I've already got the boots. We do. Well, which boots are they? Yeah, they're the boots that you get from the gnome who's poisoned. I'll join her. Which boots? The boots are striding. I think I'm wearing them. Oh, okay. Or Shadowheart is. Shadowheart's wearing boots of speed. Now you're probably wearing the boots of striding. You are, in fact, wearing the boots in question. They're like, hey, um, can we have the boots now? And they're just like, and you're just like, you'll have to pull them off my dead little toesies. And then Monk just comes up and punches them in the face. It's like... <laughs> Okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's... I think we might have killed them, though. I think those are the dual guard we we killed to uh, um, for the other quest. I believe they, they bring up the boots when you're on your way back to the... when you get to Grimforge as well, because I they're think asked so. about the boots. Maybe. Oh, what am I go? doing? Uh, hang on. Uh, traders. Oh, uh... I thought you had already gone to the beach. Whoops. Not yet. Can I trade? I can trade with you. You know, I think this may end up... Like, I don't know if anything else that we do is ever going to quite be... I mean, even if we did Diablo, I don't think it's going to be as... I mean, no, Diablo will probably be just as long as this would be. I... I... I think I... Uh, uh, anyway, what do you say? Trying to find someone with enough money for.
I don't know why this is marked as wares. And not well, mark to you. most things. But I mean, like the potion. No, the, the potion of healing. Oh, okay. Yeah, why was that marked as wares? Unless I nudged it when I was supposed to have sent it to you. I must have hit that instead. Are we ever going to use Stinking Cloud, do you think? Doubt it. Sent to you to sell. What about Sleep well, Pro I Sleep Storm does damage, doesn't it? Or is that the one that only does the... Um... Uh, calls for the storm to disrupt the concentration of spellcasters, douse those fires, and creates an icy surface. I don't know. I mean, uh, that, oh, oh, that doesn't do damage, but it does break concentration, which can come in handy, so... Yeah. Hang on to that. What about magic weapon? Probably not. Grant to wear, send to Absurdia. Well, if I send these, I'm not sending them to her because she's out of money. Oh. Uh, let's see if a melaman. Oh, we got a scroll of haste. That could be interesting. The right situation. Like, you know, a boss fight that's coming up when we get to Grim Forge. True. All righty. Profit. Okay. Alright, uh, to the beach. The beach. Oh god, now I've got Mr. Bean in my head going, the beach. Have you received Mr. Bean's vacation? No. I haven't, I, I've only watched, like, odds and ends of it. Like, I haven't watched anything in, like, there's the odd episodes. Yeah, we watched several of those, and then we, I think the only one of the movies we saw was his vacation where he was trying to go to the beach. That was hilarious. Alright, ready for the boat? Yep. I was gonna... Oh, you know, I just realized we probably should have taken a short rest to get wheel spells back, but... Oh, in that case. Or do you have your Song of Rest up? I do have Song of Rest, so I can do that instead. Okay. All right, ready? Yep. Why did it change me to wheel? Have you thought more about what items you want to make with the Andamantine Forge? Because you only can make two. Hmm. I made a scimitar and, and an armor. I mean, what's the use of it really? Like, is it, are they any particularly good or not? Well, the real? first thing to note is that the Animantine weapons always crit against objects. So if you want to take out at, like a wall or like a, like a something that's blocking something else, you'll always deal a critical hit to that item. Okay. Which is and doors and stuff are effective. And the armor makes you immune to critical hits, as well as having a plus one to defense. Okay, so yeah, these are the guys we killed. Well, they don't know that. Where's Gek? Who are you? I mean... Maybe the second one? I'd rather, I mean, I'd rather just kill them, to be honest. Sure, if that's what you want to do. I mean, these ones I don't mind gaining the XP from. Okay. Get her, fellas. I mean, it's less people we have to fight later anyways. Because I ended up fighting all these guys at one giant fight. All right. Um... Oh, yeah, no, no. All right, hold on, hold on. Let's plan first. Um, I'm already in front of this guy. I might need your help he's to take this only... guy down. Yeah, I was saying he's the only one I can get to, so... Oh, he's the only one you can reach? I think so, yeah. 
because we're right, on this uh, boat and there's no way across the island without jumping or misty stepping. All right, so come up to here and just do your two attacks. Don't use your bonus action yet. Okay, uh, let's see. I very much like to get to use my bonus action because I have a um, oh, you know, extra um, damage added to it. <laughs> all right, um, just an unarmed strike though. Don't go with. Don't waste resources. I'm gonna have to fix my wheel. They got messed up again. He's dead. Oh uh, well, there goes uh, my uh, my plan. Sorry. <laughs> okay, now what do I do for my turn? Uh, uh you got a you got spells. You can spell somebody over there. Or that's shoot. true. Uh, I mean, does unless it's an AOE, I'm going to do more damage from just shooting someone twice. Um. Can you get multiple people in like a shatter? That's a good question. I think you can like at least three of them. Yes, I can. Boom. What gives? Uh, so it's I'm supposed all... to be an earth shattering kaboom. Um that would make the damage it's... yeah, let's do it. Yeah, they did not take yeah. that very well. The only trouble is, is that that wouldn't, that doesn't kill anyone. But one nothing I can do about that. So it's okay. One of them will move, and then Will can get a turn, and Will can buy me pick off two of them with Eldritch Blast. If he's uh, like... to not give a turn to one of them, but there's nothing I can do about that. So. Um, best I can do is end my turn for the moment and see what they do. Nothing okay, good. Can... All, right, All right, so let's have a look. Uh, how about one of the ones who's um, wounded, so who's next in initiative order? Because uh, be, double hit. This one is next in initiative order right here. Uh, Bone. Well, what, one of the. Well, one basically one of the two who's wounded because I don't think you can one shot. From I can fresh. Well, let's see. My damage is up to possibly 14. Wait, so... you got a spell source, don't you? Huh? you got a spell source, right? Why not yeah. fireball? Oh, I mean, that's a fair question. <laughs> Me and my fireballs. Oh, you could my... get in three of them as well. My demon hipster chicks. You can get three. Yes. Uh, the ones here on the... I hate when that happens. Yeah, I know, me too. It never did that for me, but... Uh, ah! Oh. That's satisfying. And I didn't even do it. Critical ah. miss. Ah! Uh, fuck you, buddy! Right. Uh, I think the only That's way okay. she's going to be productive is if she just jump. jumps over her. I'm saying I, I'm gonna I'm not gonna jump, I'm gonna misty step on my turn if there's enemies left over there. I mean I guess jumping would be fun too. Yeah, no point in Missy stepping. I'll just jump over there. Hell, at this point, it might be easy just to shoot them. That's what I'm going to do. Alright, do your just standard um, stuff, and then we'll see what I can... He's got seven oh, yeah, left. There's... I could easily finish him with an unarmed. Yeah, just oh, regular on arms. Because I can't, because... You uh, jumped. I jumped, yeah. So you're going to have to shoot him. Alright, don't forget to loot the body of that guy over there. Yep. Jorgoral's greatsword. Uh, oh, it's just a plus one. Um, probably no, had to wear... Cause no, just plus one, and I'm pretty sure I've got... 
I was about to say, could you let me? I didn't want to listen into that game. I didn't mean to, to click on him. Um, <laughs> one thing to note with the, um, because I didn't get to finish what I was saying about the uh, item from the forge. When we kill the golem, um, there's going to be a free, um, apparently if I land in the water, it's death. <laughs> oh, it, oh, no, it is death. It is. I know. Uh, do you know how I know that? Because you got knocked in the water. No, uh, I back when I was using Shadowheart as a druid, I used Thorn Whip on one of the one of the dwarves in this fight, and insta killed him. Wow. <laughs> and and I got a trophy for it because it's the trophy for dealing uh killing someone with full damage. Because that's classified as full damage. But does it make any sense because it's water? But anyways, um, so when we destroy the golem, it'll have a helmet that's on it, and if you wear the helmet, it makes you immune to critical hits. So let's say, for example, if you give Shadowheart that helmet, it'll make her completely immune to all crits for the rest of the game. Uh. And there's not that much useful headwear, but you have to be proficient in heavy armor to wear it. So. Well, she is, thanks for being a paladin. I believe the weapons you can make are a scimitar, a longsword, a shield... Splint mail and I want to say. Ooh. Um, oh, what kind of short bow do you have, may I ask? Plus one short bow, I think. Okay, so same as me. So you don't mind if I take the one that's also plus one, but also has a chance to inflict the frightened condition? No, you're fine. Cool. Yeah, I had to fight uh, that guy and his minions in the room because I just I, I I had left everyone alive in the tower and then everybody turned on me all at once. We had to fight the entire building all at once. I'm trying to think maybe we should sort of plan a way to just sort of uh, assassinate people one by one or group by group. But I'm thinking we might just have to, unless we want to ally ourselves with dwarves, which I don't particularly nope, want to do. Don't want to do that. Roger, awful people. <laughs> They are they are awful people, aren't they? Um, yeah. Like reading the Driss books has given me a new hatred for the Duragar for what they did. Jeez, that bad, huh? I mean, uh, Bruner lost. Uh, I think Bruner lost a finger or hand. I can't remember for sure, but he got pretty badly messed up by the Duragar. All right. Uh, ready for me to continue? Yep. Everyone else has been looted, right? Yep. Anything that was you know remotely valuable was taken. Oh. It's ready to sail. I think there's some merchants here you may want to uh, trade with before take, we go all murder, take, yeah. murder, killy killy. Yeah, uh, I know, I know. And, and also um, music. Yeah. There's still a trophy for me to get, and this is technically a place for people who might appreciate it. Unlike the Mike and Nicole, even though they don't have money. <laughs> huh. I mean, they do appreciate it, they just can't show it in a way that helps toward a trophy. Oh god, her. Sorry. Uh... And meanwhile, your, uh, your girlfriend just starts to fangirl. <laughs> That'll hurt. I meant uh, your character's girlfriend. Company's calling. You know, I Hello. I was so sure these guys were going to attack me when I first got here. Walking seems like. Got any reason I shouldn't sever your head and toss it to the rope? Because you die trying. So much for another fight. Like this. Another fight quite so soon. Uh. I'll be serving yours, it's all the same. I don't mind if they want to just declare war, but I thought you wanted to... Yeah, I know, I'm not... I, 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 I have put reasons. That right? And just what do... oh. I have no intention of saying I'm a true soul. Even if they think I am. You're one of them cult freaks. 
felt the tingle. In that case, let's talk business. Your twat's old friend near caused a rockfall, trapped tighter than a hornet's arse. Couple of known slaves stuck with him, too. Little bastards. You absolute shaggers owe us a crap load of coin. You want through? Make a donation. <laughs> My character got ready to fight. Mostly. Easy to feed. Fat bums for digging. That's a problem for you. You'll work through it, Jarg. Now pay up. Don't got all day. Unclog your hole. Just shitting around. But I'm warning you. That twat soul ain't settled up soon. There'll be hell to pay for the lot of you cult buggers. Says the person who sides with him when the fight starts, but whatever. Before their work to death, that is. Oh, um, Joe. Yeah? Do you have a speak to animals by any chance, or a scroll to speak to animals? Looking ahead. Uh, I don't, I don't know. Because you can actually convince the spiders that are down here on this, uh, in this area to, uh, leave and go serve Lolf, if you can talk to them. I don't want them to go serve Lolf. But then they're not here to attack you later. Oh, then I'll just milk them for XP. Rather Probably. kill them now than, 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 than let them get hulked up by Lolf with some of our, uh... Silk magic or whatever. Anyway. May as well play for these people first. Yeah, I know that's what that is exactly what I was thinking. Might want a quick save just in case you fail the check. <laughs> it already ordered. It already ordered save, so I'll just okay. reload that. Sort of wish I could play now. Do you know how much gold you've made off of uh, performing? No, lost count. I should have been capturing a tracker, but I've been just, I'm letting the game do it for me. Once I get the trophy, I'll stop doing it. Okay. Well, there'll be lots of people worth... to play for in Baldur's Gate when we get there. Yeah, exactly. But, like, you know me. Get it as soon as possible. Yeah. Rock for ages. Isn't this where we pick up the the, uh, the the objective to get the the bomb? Yeah, but we get it from the slaves. Yeah, we get the bomb from the slaves, but the, the quest is over here. I mean, mm, pretty sure it's uh, you know around the area of the rockfall, which isn't here. Oh, I thought this guy gave it to me, the stonemason. Oh, of he, course he, it he is. is. My 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 stream's not. Uh... Why doesn't it update? I thought I was supposed to update automatically. Okay, thanks for the heads up, but well, That's we've weird. only got like 15 minutes left, so there's no point changing it now. That's weird. Maya's got the right correct game on it. Uh, we missed you in Oblivion today, D. Um, also, uh, y'all leveled up last night, so Dala can go to level 3 um, when you get a chance. I thought there were small people here. I'm surprised the slaves have uh, money on them to give to you. They're not slaves. Oh, the stone sense. Oh, he, he's kind of nice for a Grovar. I guess there, are, there can be nice Grovar. There's one here, too. I know. No, I've got all selected. There's one way just... over here. You're fine. I understand, D. How peculiar. 
smooth face, cobbled edges. They're a sign. They must be. A sun dweller in these parts. Look here, my t as rare as a smile in Shindlerin, you might say. But I've no skill for slaving. I prefer chisel to cane. But these learned eyes reach their limits. And so I must humbly request yours. The rock, the rubble, all of it, if I may be so bold. Take a look. Tell me what you see. And be thorough. Oh no. What? No, I I I I I I can't. I can't do that to him. Which one? The deception. Ah. Uh, in fact, it was hand forged by a flump poker. That may be going too far, yeah. Especially since he's been friendly. Oh, I I can't I can't in conscience do that. Yeah, thanks to that um, headband of intellect. Aren't you glad I suggested that you wear that now? Oh. <laughs> Adamantine. Ah, the one we're going to have to fight. Yep. What do you think? we got to fight, got to beat him without dropping the hammer on him too, which... I know how to do it. It's just going to take some finessing. We're going to need to bring Gale in for it. How fascinating. But we can talk more about that when we reach the forge. It'll be easier to show you everything than actually try to um, explain it without you seeing the setup. Mythic metal atop stone hewn by the devoted. That's to say nothing of this tale of an invulnerable protector. It's unfortunate the Sharan's successors found no proof. Doesn't explain this infernal plate I found, though. Here. Take it. Perhaps you'll be able to figure out why it's here. But my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I must get to it. Well, let's see what you've got. Yeah, I have to strain to see what he's actually selling because I can't. Doesn't show me that. Not much actually. Just some spell scrolls and some basic material. Camp supplies though. What elixir was that? I'm surprised you're not using a Minthelia's Liar. Well, I know, I got it from, you know, uh... Yeah. So it's better than just war loot for something like that, you know? It'd be funny if she does show up in Moonrise, um, and she's just completely naked. Because <laughs> we took every ounce of clothes from her. <laughs> Uh, uh, let me put it this way. I'll be glad that I've got my stream set to uh, for uh, mature audiences. Yes, same. Where did I? Where's the? What, what are you looking for? This. Uh, send to camp. Okay. Um, I don't think there's anything else I want, unless there's you something you want. Look at elixir in the first slot there. I where? Where? Go back to his first uh, inventory slot. Uh, battle mage's power drink to increase the effectiveness of your spells. You will gain three arcane acuity. Okay, what's the one to the right of it? Fire resistance. Okay, no. Oh, 
nothing interesting there, that to my knowledge. This could be good though, the po the arrows. Yeah. We do have potions of animal speaking. Oh, we gotta use these at some point. We should use these and so you can talk to the strange ox and the druid camp. We have two elixirs of fire resistance. Huh. Also, this is kind of useless. Problem is, I don't know what it is. Well, Elixir where it of is dark now. Vision. It's um up near the top of your list. It's the elixir of dark vision. Ah, I see it. Cheers. Right, I think that's everything. Yeah, we might have to make the assault upon uh, Grimforge for next week. We've got seven minutes to. Yeah, no, I got you. I think maybe we can try and pick up the quest to rescue to rescue get the, the miners at least. Yeah. Yeah, I got the quest for it, and that should be it. But yeah, I think that's everything. So that's, that's all cool. indeed. You know, it's kind of strange that we're like almost halfway to the maximum level and we're only still in Act 1. I know, right? It's kind of like you level so slowly in Acts 2 and 3 by comparison to how fast you grow in Act 1. I mean, that's true in all D&D &D, though, because, uh, it, because the amount of XP in each level up grows that's exponentially. True. Oh, I thought there was two of you. Um, oh well, I'll settle for one. Oh, there's another one. There's a scrying eye coming too. No, never mind. It's huh. not coming up here. Oh, okay. I wonder, I know they're slaves, so I'd be surprised, but... I mean, it's worth a shot. Oh, yeah, they did have goals. <laughs> By the way, are you holding down X at the... Yeah, selecting all the gold pieces at once and just picking them up that yes. way. Okay, that's just so much more. You know, I noticed that the slave keepers didn't drop any gold. I know. Yeah, so did I. They didn't realize the slaves pickpocketed all their gold. <laughs> <laughs> Minor rebellions. I'm gonna enjoy killing my master Donald. Like. I'm going to push him right in the lava. Ah, uh, that won't kill them guaranteed, I'm afraid. Okay, I'll, I'll just I'll just hit him twice with the blood of the thunder, and that should do it. <laughs> yeah, that's that. That'll be more likely. I'm just making a note for future. Mine, Master Dunnell is mine. We need that smoke powder. Finamine's gone, and if she's smart, she won't be coming back. Tell the sergeant where she went. Beltran's still trapped with that maniac near. Thirty-two. That's a little excessive, isn't it? The Ridder, our prayers are answered. Mom, our friends are trapped in the cave-in. And I know a way to get them out. Bug, please. 
truth or near will you know what he'll do we're gonna kill the truth I've got no choice Larida we have to chance it a few days cut off his hand and take it to the mic uh there's a she's a sapper what set off a blast and ran off I was we trying to say stop singing while the sorry. talking. I'll mark your map. If Philemine made it, you'll find her there. She'll have the stuff to blow that tunnel wide open and get Beldron and the rest out. Hey, we're clean for a change. I wonder when that happened. Please, please don't hurt my Phil. I beg you. Hurry. Our people won't last in that cave in forever. I feel so sorry for her, you know. Yeah. She like, she considers Philomena the love of her life, and you Clean up this mess. Here dies, heads roll. And I still got two minutes, so let's see if there's anyone else I can uh, I can sort of get some These point two from. Come. And there's. Oh. oh. Critical fail. Was it? Bloody hell. Well, uh... Did you save? Well, frankly, I can just... I can just leave and then try again next time we, uh... Yeah. Next time we pick up. Unless right, let's okay. me try again. Yeah, no, not the same people. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll just when I, I'll reload the save when I reload the save for the next stream, I guess. All right. Um, yeah, so that's it. Uh, thank you for joining us. This has um, been part fourteen have, of Baldur's Gate three. We've been the Piracy Buddies, and uh, we'll be picking up with any luck same time next week. So hope to see you there. Uh, play more games. And have a good evening, everyone. Bye, everyone.